Hi, this is a brief video description of the wood fuel and home heating course. Now it's not just about getting a few sticks, putting them in a steel box and setting fire to them. There's a whole raft of other issues and technologies that surround this basic form of home heating. The uh, course venues will be listed in the description below the video. So let's get on with it. Seasoning firewood in the uh, cordwood or short logwood length. Wood sheds and final seasoning and storing the firewood for winter. Traditional wood stoves. A boiler, cooker, heater. This runs all the hot water, the cooking and the central heating. Homemade stoves and such art forms. And a bit about firewood production. And if the interest is there, we can go into a little bit about carbon capture, um, designing woodlands, growing uh, trees for firewood production, habitat creation. The subject is endless, but I'll only do that if the interest is there. Flue pipes and roofs and chimneys and liners which of course always comes into the quality of the firewood as well and a lot of people think that you just cut trees down and burn them not the case you can get so much more out of your firewood and you create a very clean environment if you are able to season your timber correctly. You see that stove is running. You might just see a little bit of haze, but it is smokeless. And air wash type stoves with a vent at the bottom and a vent at the top. And this one's got a thermostatic control on the side. And using older technology stoves, like this Rayburn number six and biomass boilers this one will run on log or pellet and pellet handling systems and pellet boilers and we're going to cover about central heating with radiators and we'll be covering domestic hot water and how that can be integrated with solar. And we'll be covering quite a lot about moisture content and it, how it affects the burning properties.